Facing dozens of lawsuits over unpaid claims from the Hermit's Peak Calf Canyon wildfire, the federal office handling those claims is now without a director. News 13's Madison Connor has more. We have received some invaluable feedback. That's the now former director of FEMA's Hermit's Peak Calf Canyon Claims Office, Angela Gladwell, who stepped down from the top role Wednesday. Uh, Angela Gladwell built this program from the ground up and it was never going to be easy. FEMA says the roughly year-old operation is now consolidating from three offices to a single long-term location. Attorney Brian Colon represents dozens of wildfire victims who are suing for late unpaid claims. My law firm for months, the people of northern New Mexico for months, elected officials, public policy leaders have all said that Gladwell had to go. Cologne claims FEMA is breaking their own federal rules by not paying property owners for losses within the mandated 180 day time frame. We have currently, as of yesterday, filed a half a dozen lawsuits for about 84 plaintiffs who have all been traumatized again by the federal government. Cologne believes Director Gladwell's exit is a first step in the right direction for victims. Continuing with Gladwell was not the solution. At this point, what we want to make sure is that we don't replace a failed bureaucrat with another bureaucrat. We are in the beginning stages of this transition. Leadership in New Mexico and all across FEMA have this as a major priority. The federal agency says it's ready to make improvements moving forward. We need to do that faster. We need to streamline processes for people who've been affected. We need to cut red tape. We need to reduce the documentation burden on people who've been affected. Madison Connor, KRQE News 13. FEMA says outstanding claims will continue to be processed without interruption despite Gladwell's departure. So far, the agency has paid out $319 million in claims to those affected by the fire.